Hey guys, this is going to be a real quick video. The whole point is just to get you thinking outside of the box and hopefully to inspire you. Growing up, my mom always tried to get me to think about new ways to do things and different ways to reuse things. Almost anything can be used as a planter. You don't just have to stick with the ordinary pots and window baskets. The fun part about planting up things that weren't meant to be planters is that you can add your own flair and personality to your garden. I was out shopping and I ran across a shower caddy and I thought how cute would this look filled up with plants. I'm pretty sure everything looks better if you can add plants, so if there is any possible way, I'll try to find it. So when you're out shopping or yard sailing, just be looking for containers of any kind. They don't have to have drainage, they can be full of holes like this, I mean look at the back of this is completely open. I've got a couple of cute baskets right here that can be made into planters, and if you don't know how to plant up a container without drainage, check out my other video right here and it'll show you everything that you need. Um, so today, I'm going to plant up this caddy. Since you guys all know how to do the planting part, we're gonna fast forward that part, but there's a couple things I wanted to tell you first. If you do choose a container like this that needs to be lined, there's a few different things you can use. There's burlap, you can do a double layer of burlap and that works really nice. You can use a form of cocoa fiber here, um, but I actually prefer to use moss. I think it's really pretty and natural looking. So what I'll do is I will get the moss wet so it's moldable, we'll line the back and the front with the moss, and then the most important part is after you get done with that, you wanna put an inside liner of burlap, and that'll keep the soil from falling out. I'm gonna get started planting this up. Ta-da, here is the finished product. So here's a quick recap of what I did. I put some moss in a bowl of water and then squeezed out the excess. And then I took that moss and lined the outside of the container. Then I took a piece of burlap and lined the inside of the moss. And then you can plant. Um, you can leave all the excess burlap and moss hanging over the sides until you're all done planting and then cut um, kind of close and then fold the extra over the top of the soil. I always use a little bit of extra moss just to top dress the soil and make it look pretty. And I chose succulents for this planter because I love succulents and because they are really water friendly and since this doesn't have a very big reservoir, it's perfect for them. And then let me show you the back of it. See, it is completely finished all the way around. I hope you liked the video. Please leave a comment if you have any suggestions or other ideas for planters. I would love to hear them. See you guys next time.